welcome back to my channel. I've come on today to show you probably the last one of the book nooks that I've made. This one has taken the longest to complete just with it being so difficult um, to do. Super glue has helped but there's so many parts to this one that just wouldn't stick um, so it has taken me a while. I did put it away and I've got it back out again and thankfully I have completed so I can sit on the shelf in my craft room alongside my other ones. But it's called The Firefly Forest and this one was from Timu. So it um, it was the cheapest out of all of them that I've bought recently. And I have adapted it um, in quite a few areas. Like on the front where there's this the little sort of grassy bits. It's actually where there's super glue. You can actually see on the front, so I've just stuck little greenery on the front to disguise that. So it isn't exactly as it should be. I've adapted quite a few bits inside as well. When you turn it to the side, it says Firefly Forest on that side there. And, um, there is, if you look on the top, there's a Perspex dome on the top. I actually used a sheet of my shrink plastic to create that. The one that came with the kit just wasn't big enough. It was going to be really difficult to stick. So I've cut a, a larger piece of shrink plastic. There is actually a little garden in the top as well with a toadstool. The main part of it is obviously inside here. So what I'll do is I'll switch the ring light off and I shall switch it on and as you can see so it is a firefly forest so all these lights I guess are fireflies and inside there's little houses and little bird boxes and toadstools and lots of leaves and trees and it reaches up to the to the roof and there is a, two mirrors at the back and they're on an angle, opposite angles to each other. So it, it does, when you actually look in it, when you've got it in the flesh rather than on camera, I don't think it's showing on camera. It looks as if it's going on and on deep into the forest, which is cool, really. I, I really like that. It's very clever. And there is a little green LED light in the bottom of there and the rest of them are, are white. So yeah, as I say, this will be the last one I think I show on my channel. Um, I don't know whether I'll do any more. I think I've maybe certainly exhausted the ones that I've fancied doing when I look at um, Amazon and other websites. There isn't any more really that take my fancy. These are the ones I really wanted to, to do. All of the others look quite similar to each other. So I just, I think I'll call that little hobby done for now. I think get back to my proper paper crafting but yeah a lot of fun so I'll include some pictures as well just to see if you can work out the little forest inside a little bit better on pictures on the photos so thanks for watching and I'll see you all again soon bye for now